We begin with breaking news tonight at 5. A child recovering tonight after a shooting in Raleigh. I'm Rudy Williams. And I'm Pepper Baker. Police responded to the shooting on Teresa Cove. And our Kevin McNamara is live from the scene there. Kevin, what do you know? Yeah, that's right, Rudy Pepper. As you said, I'm here at Teresa Cove right now in Raleigh. This happened a little after 3.30 p.m. That's when MPD says a child was shot by a self-inflicted wound. Now I'll get out of the shot. You can see it a little bit better here now. Uh, there's a couple cruisers here with MPD as well as a detective. Uh, again, this happened just after 3.30 uh, where a child suffered a self-inflicted gunshot wound. Now MPD says they are unclear uh, on how exactly that boy got uh, in possession of the gun. That's still under investigation. One thing they also said uh, is that no arrest has been made at this time. Uh, but one thing I can say just in the time that we've been here with ABC 24, we did see uh, an individual be led out of the home uh, on the left side of your screen and was taken into one of the police cruisers here uh, in handcuffs. So that is certainly still uh, an active investigation. Uh, as we continue to try and learn more. Again, we are here in Raleigh uh, on Teresa Cove, where a child was transported to Le Bonner with non-critical uh, injuries, crucially. So certainly a lot to still investigate here. Again, police saying they're not sure uh, how that individual got in possession of a weapon. No arrests yet, although we have seen someone led away in handcuffs into a cruiser. So we'll keep following the story for you on ABC 24 uh, all night long. For now, live in Raleigh, Kevin McNamara. Back We're happy to hear that boy might be okay, all right?